All right, we here, baby. We here. Well, we're almost here. 50 seconds. Uh, we're about to go off, and then, of course, the event starts this late. Yeah, that sucks. Well, as long as you don't get spoiled, come back here and watch, uh, watch it with your boy. Later. I mean, just don't look at my channel, I guess. I, I, I'll blow, like, a million highlights. So, <laughs> anyway, 125 people here. What's up, babies? One love. The Gore Centipede? Uh, you don't want to see that. <laughs> I keep hearing where it got pushed back, so I'm not sure if it'll show up. Yeah, because they always do like to... Um, let's crank this up. Uh, they do like to show um, Resident Evil games pretty close to when they're supposed to come out, so... They got the person. Yeah, I saw that. All right. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Yeah. All right. Let's get to it, baby. Give me the goods. I want to see the goods. Hey, give me the goods. I want to see the goods. Where's Keeley? That's what I want to see. Please welcome to the stage, the creator of the Game Awards. Yeah, that's Kyle Bossman. Keeley. I know that. Is the audio good? Will there be a sex scene in the Gorgon? Well, that's all the game is. It's just one really long sex scene. Hey! Not for real, though. Love of content. Thank you, Daryl Knights. I appreciate it. I really do. Thank you. I love you, too. Thank you. Shoutouts. Hello, Shout outs. I appreciate Welcome it. Welcome to Summer Game Fest 2024. You ready to see some video games? Nah. Nah. We are so thrilled to be Sonic here with movie. you, and this is a showcase of what's next for games live from the YouTube theater here in L.A. Now, if you're watching this show, first of all, welcome. I know everyone around the world is joining us for this special moment. And I know if you watch this show, you don't just play games. You <coughs> deeply care about this art form and the health of this industry. The good news is that we have a lot of amazing games to show you from creators Whip around out, Jeff. the world Let me see it. over the next two hours. Pin, you know, it's, yeah, <laughs> but let's also a lot of games he this says, has right? been a tumultuous and difficult year oh is he actually gonna bring this up studio closures which have disappointed all of us but there's also something else happening our industry is evolving and changing and thanks to digital distribution smaller teams and new creators are finding incredible success Take a look at this list from Game Discover of the top 10 best selling oh, true, new yeah. games on Steam so far this wow, year. Wow, Dragon's Dog with two's on there? Yeah, I keep hearing about Buckshot Roulette. Deep Rock. Games, but the other eight Man, come it. from indie, mid sized teams or solo developers. So is he saying, now like, everybody list, gets fired? It's make your own right? shit. I get inspired that new ideas, new teams, and smaller creators. Can and Supermarket Simulator? I didn't even know that was a game. It's a reminder to big companies that they have to treat their developers right because today there are many paths to sustainability and success. Hell yeah. And that's what makes this industry so, so great. Yeah, all right. I, f I feel and like you should have said this more on this Twitter, but that's cool that you talk about. It just started. Hours, uh, we'll big franchises on stage like Star Wars, Batman, and Harry Potter. Oh, they're showing Batman? Smaller titles, including a few games made by single individuals and first-time creators that we invited to be part of this show <clears> because <throat> we think this platform is important as a way to show you new things that you might not even know about. So when you see a game that piques your interest, Please wish list it, or even better, send it to a friend and get them excited. That's how we together can grow the That's game. That's how I win. win. This is and how I win. Do that today over the next two hours, as we have a lot of games to show you. Plus, day of the devs directly after with yeah. even more indie titles. So, should we get to the games? Yeah. Woo. I'm doing good. Right. What's up, Dane? It all right. Begins right now. Here Give me some. Our first announcement. Yeah, there we go. Let's get to it, baby. Give me it. Next. Uh, hey, what? Hello, Lego. This is a hot dog guy auditioning for the, um, ooh, the lead and unannounced okay. action game. Wow. We see you as more of a sidekick. Oh, sure. I get that a lot, but uh, check out my range. Okay, okay. Mm -la -la. This, this <laughs> voice sounds familiar. Empathy. Oh, hilarity. <laughs> this guy. Okay. Oh, what game is this? Anyway? Oh, okay. Gorilla. Wait, 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 what? What? What the fuck? Why is it? Why? Hey, need costume. I gotta get me one of those. Ooh, what? Wait, why does she have a lot of personality? That's not right. 
that hot dog uh, guy is Aloy. Is this like an amazing video game lead? Thunderjaw went. Oh, is this gonna be a bunch of like Sony games? Getting No, this is a wait, is this a Horizon game? That's it? Is it gonna be a bunch of PlayStation? What? <laughs> That's so, so random. It's got leaked. Of course it did. Friendly hero hunting with her pals. Okay. It looks fun. <laughs> wow, what is this place? Collecting all the Is that the same actress? Uh, what's her name? It doesn't what sound like her. And making a home. Uh, what? Uh, I don't know. Now it. Uh, uh, oh, uh, it's the Thunder Jaw. <laughs> that has nothing like Horizon. Alright, so. I'm so confused. Oh, then we're gonna dance. I'm like waiting for other PlayStation characters to show up. <laughs> Is this gonna be called? <laughs> I like it just disappeared. It's just gonna be called Lego Horizon Adventures. Okay. Wow. Oh no. Oh, wait. What? It's coming to Switch. <laughs> wow. Xbox got fucked. <laughs> Wow. What, what that was random as shit. There you go. Wasn't that fun? That was Lego Horizon. Wasn't Avengers. that fun? Out later this year for wow. PlayStation right. also Looks day fun. One on PC. Shit, and I'll play it. Switch. Yeah, why not? It's a playful Nintendo the Switch. That's weird. The Horizon designed with two player action in mind, supporting couch and online co-op. <laughs> Xbox right, and Now we're going to completely shift the tone All to right. the next game from Torn Banner Studios, the developers behind Chivalry 2. For their next project, they are proud to announce sure, No think. More Room in Hell 2, the sequel to the 2011 award-winning source mod. I kind of remember that. Wait, I kind of remember that. It's up to Why you did you just to show find it? your friends and survive. One by one game. Shut up. <laughs> Here is the first look. Yeah, all right, that was, that was a cool, that, that was just like, I, my brain was not, I, I was very confused throughout the entire trailer. Like I was waiting for there to be like some twist, like it's actually a bunch of PlayStation characters. Like, it didn't feel like a ride. That was cool. It was definitely cool. It's just... Alright, this I'm not playing, so I don't even know why they're showing this. <laughs> Average Xbox L. Well... Yeah. This looks tense. Me no like. This is the kind of game where if everybody else died in my crew, then I'd just stop playing the game. Like, that would be the same thing with Lethal Company. Like, if I was playing that and uh, and everybody else died, I'd be like, well, I guess I'm jumping off because fuck this. I'm not dealing with this by myself. <laughs> fuck off! Didn't you hear him? Fuck off. Permadeath. So... So it's more like a DayZ style game, right? Then that means massive replayable map. Okay. I guess so then. Eight players co-op, yeah. Fuck off! I, I I think no more room. I remember that title. I remember I think me and a couple other people wanted to play at one point. I didn't know it was the same guys that did Chivalry though. I wish I had said. I wish I had one. Coming this Halloween looks really, really intense. All right. Yeah. To introduce our next I'm going to turn this up a little bit. Welcoming someone who I've known for over a decade. She's been a huge fan of some of our reveals like Street Fighter VI a few years ago and, of course, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth last year when she was sitting in the audience. Well, this year, she's joining us on stage. We're thrilled to have her with us. Please welcome Curious Joy. Oh, just, I was about to say Curious George. It's like, George, what? Curious Joy, okay. Thank you, Jeff. Hi, no everyone. I am so excited to be here at Summer Game Fest. I'm here with you today Wait, Joy. to share some even more super isn't fun that, trailers. JOI, so isn't that a thing? Let's get straight to another world premiere. This it's is a George. highly anticipated game from a beloved franchise. Let's take a look. Oh, uh, is he doing this because a lot of people complained that there was as not no Wichita women Wichita on stage Wichita last year for uh, the Game Awards or something? I bet that's exactly. Oh, wait, hold on. What's this? To Quidditch, we've all wondered, do I have what it takes? To be the next Quidditch star? A Quidditch game? <laughs> yeah, that's what it means. 
<laughs> Curious jerk off instruction, whatever. Harold. To chase your dreams at any price. Yeah, I remember people were like freaking out about that. Like it matters. I don't want anybody on stage, honestly. No challenge is too great. Unless it's a dog. Bring a dog up. I'll listen to a dog talk about a game. This is kinda cool. A Quidditch game? Just straight up. Do you have the heart of a Quidditch champion? I mean this makes sense. Especially an online game. I will say that was a very boring shot right at the end. I mean, it's cool if they can make like a successful like Rocket League style. Uh... Okay, next chapter takes flight. Okay. Day one with what? What was that say? Day one with something? That's it... Harry Potter Quidditch Champions launching okay. worldwide on September 3rd for consoles and PC. Cool. Now we move from the Potterverse to a brand new world. <laughs> It Ooh. hails from a single developer. Oh, here Gavin we go. Here's that one, one Seattle, developer. Who's been making games all by himself for a decade. His last title, Choo Choo Charles, was a fan. Oh, oh! Me Choo Choo Charles guy. Game a few months ago. He said, yeah. He really wanted to debut it here. Get ready to backstab, race, or cooperate with up to 20 of your friends. Oh. In Cuff Bust. C cuff bust. Wait, what? All right, hold on. Wait, hold on. Oh my god, it's a like multiplayer like break out of jail game. Oh, that's great, dude. It's like cops and robbers, except you know. Wait, whoa. <laughs> that animation got me. <laughs> Why is that? Why is that funny looking? <laughs> I like the animation on these guys. It's very like, like they're doing the Spider Verse thing where they they're like in lower frame rate. Dude, that's a stream. I don't know. <laughs> this looks great. What the hell? Yeah, I get the screwdriver. Put that in someone's neck. <laughs> I like it's like cute characters. Oh my god, so it's, it's gonna be like randomly generated. It has a bunch of different like ways to escape or whatever. I assume it would be randomly generated. <laughs> I like, I like this. Oh yeah, it better have proximity chat, 100%. Oh! <laughs> I like their whole voices. What, who stole it? So it's like a bunch of different, maybe like, yeah, like it's every man for himself, too, so. Oh my god. Yeah, see, you shouldn't have fucked around, bro. You should have waited for us. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. Blitz down their minds. Oh, shit. <laughs> Cuff bust. Maybe, I don't know, TBH. <laughs> that looks great. All right, that's sold. A one, right? I remember that's all made <laughs> sold. by one person. Yep. Congratulations, Gavin. So Damn, that on sold. Stage. That looks really good. Right. Next one of this year's <laughs> most anticipated games is Star Wars Outlaws, coming out on August 30th yeah. from Ubisoft and Lucasfilm Games. Yeah, to the some people, it's their most Star anticipated game yeah. where you live the life of a scoundrel. On Monday at 12 p.m. Pacific, you'll get to yeah, see yeah, a yeah. full gameplay. I was right when I said they'd show a trailer Ubisoft for this. Event, streaming is part. Uh, and then say it will lead events. into. But right now yeah, go. we've got an exclusive new glimpse at the game, yeah. just a small taste of what's to come. Maybe they fixed her face. A friend needs and before someone says anything, I don't care if she's attractive or not. I don't fucking care. She just her face was weird. I don't care what anybody says. Oh my God! It's weird. You, you, you can't get me with oh my god it's oh my god it's, actually salacious crumb you get me with that actually never mind i was about to say you know you can't get me with cameos anymore but salacious crumb i i fuck with salacious crumb i mean this gameplay looks fun i mean the gameplay looks no i'm not in the game shut up <laughs> that's not me i'm not jabba <laughs> Unless you talk about Salacious Chrome. Lando there. So great. And by the way, yeah, it was very everything we hard to miss so far, him. I think is going to be, you know, coming out uh, hey, you know, this year. What's up, baby? Picture, but it's like, it's so cool that there's stuff that we're going to get to play in the next few months here. All right, how about well, today? Moving back to smaller oh. teams a few weeks ago. I, I thought he was going to lead into, how about today? I have to say, it is really spectacular. 
Neva comes from Nomada yeah, Studio, man. the creators of the game award winning game Grease. It chronicles the story. Oh, yeah, this game. Alma, Neva? Neva? Down to a curious I remember this. Cup. I was wondering when we see it again. At the gameplay. The first trailer was like that trailer that'll make you cry. Uh, I don't have a gaming channel now. Seven seconds. All right, let me watch this. Gris was a great game, by the way. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm ready to cry. Oh, it looks so good. God damn. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, the big wolf that died, and then you have to take care of the pup. I think. I think that was the trailer. Everybody was like, "I am crying tears." Yeah, I, I, I really, I, I like this uh, beginning so far. The beginning of the show. I'm assuming you're talking. About. Oh, that's not. That's nightmare. Oh, this one actually has combat. In it. Okay, I don't remember that from the last trailer. So, Gris doesn't really have combat. This is like an exploration puzzle game kind of more so. Uh, you do slam down though. I, I can't remember if you use that. Yeah, kind of like that. I can't remember if you use that from a. Uh, for kind. Of, th this game looks really good. <laughs> Ooh, oh, I like that. I like the reflection there. Oh, and then they become big. Or that's the one that died. Neva, there you go, yeah. I'll play it. Trust me, that game is Kevin such Hurt. a true work of art. Bro, why are you so crying? I lost all my tears to play, And there's much more coming later I'm today not in the Devolver what? Direct, which will air directly after Day of the Devs on this same stream. So we've got lots more for you. Oh, right, cool. Next, it's time I'll be watching that. Our next game announcement. I probably won't watch Day of the Devs because I'm going to edit some stuff during that. Ooh, this is Dune. Yeah, this is Dune. Study the past if you would define the future. But uh, I will be on for the Devolver thing at each, which will be an hour after this. Working in these walls of Boy. time. Let us all for death prepare. Yeah, this is definitely Dune, right? No, 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 no. I wouldn't show that. Is this Civ? Let me not then die ingloriously and without a struggle. But let me first do some great things that shall be told among men not hereafter. Be very Each strange. Shall endure this world's life until the end. Is it Civ? It's Civ, right? It's gotta be Civ. It's been long enough since Civ 6, right? Your names shall not be lost. So it shall be. So it shall be. It, uh, hey, it is. Nice. All right, cool. Sick. All right. It was already leaked. Oh, damn. Jeez. Watch the gameplay showcases all guys. Okay, Hello, cool. everyone. It's Summer Games. Ah! On behalf it's of Meyer. the Paraxis team, we are thrilled to... There he is. That's the guy that's... Civilization 7. Put his name on it. That leaked? Come PC on, man. Really? When did it leak? Next year. I'm I hate leaks, bro. I mean, I wouldn't have been that damage. excited anyway, because I never really played them. You. But, uh... Our incredible fans around the world for your overwhelming support of this franchise... Is he okay, bro? ...for <laughs> over 30 years. He's a little... We can't wait to share more. And we hope you'll join us later this summer for the full reveal of Civilization VII. In the meantime, stay civilized. I get it. It's like the game. Oh, 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 monkey! Here we go. Black Myth Wukong! Please don't say it's delayed. <laughs> I'm ready for this game, bro. Only two more months. Feet. Monkey. Oh my gosh, it's Goku. Oh, this is a straight up CG trailer. Look at that. Yeah, that suit looking sick. I don't know anything about the the Monkey King story. The Odyssey of the West story. I mean, I know a little bit, but not enough. But this game looks fucking great. Yo. Steely determination, bro. Ew. Ew. 
Black Myth Wukong! Augustonium still. Monkey! Yeah, yeah, the, the Odyssey to the West game you talking about? The. Yeah, Journey to the West is what the original story is, right? Oh! Dude! Tributing time! Oh, yeah, that's going in a jar. Nice glaze. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, this is the next one. Okay. Is this Assassin's Creed? What is this? Is this that way? Is it? Because I heard the Assassin's Creed game is good. What is it? Oh, this is Asgard's Wrath, right? Two. I don't know. Is this just an ad or is it coming to PlayStation? No, it's just an ad. All right. <laughs> PlayStation? I don't got a Meta Quest 3. The fuck? Perhaps humans were fated to build the monoliths. No. Reaching heaven and returning with a gift. No, maybe she's right. Stardust. <laughs> IG and Big Elba. Mankind was given more than it wished for. What is this? Not progress, but chaos. Chaos. Every new height. Yo, damn, cheeked up. And yet hope still glimmers. I saw it. Even Why does someone say penis in the chat? Like I agree, but what? We die to live again. The smallest creatures. I like these big the enemies, though. Well, I'm making like MMO vibes from this. I see four players, but I feel like it might also just be an MMO. What's human? Together. Okay. Game name what? I don't know. The Gory movie got a game name? Oh, I can't tell you. I can't tell you. Sorry. Garfield? Why did I show Garfield? Did you hear that later this year Prime will release a live act? Yeah, I did see that. Uh, you know what? I'll probably watch it. Yeah, a lot of people were like not super into the Kuryu uh, actor they picked. Uh, I can't really give an opinion on that, obviously. Because I don't, I, I played maybe ten hours of Zero, and I was about it. I played the the zombie game also. I played a little bit of that. That was about it. Have any of you faced Tyranids before? Yeah. Oh, these past two days, then there is much to learn. Yeah, buddy. I'm really excited for this game, bro. I just want to murder these things. Hell yeah, I want to be an angel of death, please. Like way too young, yeah. And also, he doesn't look bulky, which I don't understand why that's a problem because. The guy could bulk up, so. And, and the trailer looked fine. I mean, the the poster he looked fine. From he looked fine. Gameplay. What? All right. Welcome there? back to Summer Game Fest. Uh, we've got some amazing developer guests joining us throughout the show, and I'm uh, very excited Kojima? to introduce our first guest. Kojima. They are legendary creators who are working on a brand creators. new fantasy RPG okay, metaphor that. slated to launch this. Oh, October. Atlas! Please welcome the director and art designer of Persona 3, 4, and 5, Katsura Hashino and Shikanori Shojima. Sh Sh close to Kojima. That's the only reason why they're here. Wait, aren't they having their own little showcase like tomorrow or something like that? Or maybe they already did. Or maybe this was it. Oh my god. Atlas no That's a good talk about metaphor though, right? Thank you, everybody. I'd be very surprised to, be to talk about Persona 6. If they did, that would fucking blow my mind. Metaphor. It's a to be here with Mr. <laughs> No, they're gonna talk about metaphor. Right? Because he's working on this. Uh, hold on, hold on. Holy fuck, I'm coming. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna come. This game is an RPG. In which I need to finish Persona 5 before this comes out. Jobs, which we call archetypes. These archetypes allow you to fight against your enemies. Yeah, that'd be high too. Archetype what? Keely show, I'm gonna get high first. Seems right. Do you remember me, Gore? Hello, I do remember you. I think you ask that every time. But yeah, where is Jack Frost? Yeah, where's that? What's the fairy name? Is it just called fairy? <laughs> yeah, that is the fairy. <clears throat> where's the penis looking monster? The embodiment of yeah, the one in Persona. The there's, that, there's only one. Fears and anxieties. We gave it our all to instill each Pixie, and every archetype with a feeling of strength I was on the right and track. uniqueness in each of their designs. 
In total, there will be more than 40 types of archetypes available in the game. These archetypes okay. can gain experience and even evolve. Some of them can so evolve into stronger So they're your personas, versions. pretty much. So. あの、あたらスナルピージ。我々が作ってきたRPGの、ノウハウを全てあの、結集させて作っています。とても大きなボリュームのあの、プソナゲームズはそう Thank you very much, and we hope you enjoy Yeah, people were too excited. There's no way Persona 6 will be announced. It is said Hold on. That we all have Actually, wait, was that the pixie? Yeah, she is. Within us. The reality is... Oh, God, kids in your own bed. Embarrassing. You later, loser. A great evil flows through this This is the first time we're hearing the English. Found a way to wield Xbox shows on Sunday, which I have a feeling we'll see this there too. Honestly, no, you're not gonna call me the sun. Nice try, though. Many more protectors and followers will gather. I, I like this setting for like a Persona style game for sure. Lie dormant, fantasy, but still has that Persona feel to it. You must acquire more archetypes and bring them together. Of course. How's this? Gower. No holding back. Show me your moves. Now you've acquired a most interesting power. Yeah, the character designs look really good. Whose existence was only theoretical. Very mechanical too, which I kind of like. You wield power now. Oh, yeah. tentacles! You know what that means. Or mechanical and knights, obviously, there's all knights. Awaken. All right, that looks good. October. I forgot that's coming out in October. Why is the stream so pixelated? I, I don't know. Anybody else having that problem? I mean, streams are Such usually an honor pixelated. Such so. Shino with us uh, on stage. Thank you guys, and for that deep look at the archetype. Such stunning visual Jimmy. designs. Now we're going to jump into the Arkhamverse. Batman Arkham Shadow is a Meta Quest 3 exclusive yep. VR game coming yep. later this year. As Do Batman not have Meta Goddamn Quest 3. The mysterious Rat King and his cultish devotees. Yeah. I forgot there was a rat. The 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 oh, it's Rat King, not Batman Rat Catcher. Arkham Shadow. Is that the different character? Because people kept giving me shit. Oh, it's obviously Rat Catcher because I kept asking who's a rat. Yeah, I kept forgot Rat Catcher is a character. Um, even though I love the Suicide Squad, so you think I'd remember that? But, uh, a new darkness. Yeah, that's Roger Kirk Smith, 100%. Driving the city mad. <laughs> Your exclusive is he stupid? <laughs> the only light left <laughs> is from the fire in the streets. Oh, that's a uh... casting shadows of rats. Wait, who the fuck is that? Yeah, there was once it is Rat Catcher, right? That's what their mask looks like, right? Is Rat King the same thing? Fear is okay, no problem. See you later, Frank and I. Wait, Frank and Nader. But they're not the only What's ones junk? who can use it. It's Gordon. I wonder if they could get a... Some of the animations here are a little weird. Um... Oh, this is a... Uh, oh, uh, vampire song, right? How far yeah, 100%. To destroy him. I didn't play the song, though. Arkham Shadow. Yeah, it definitely is. It's bad on my rage. I am still just a rat in a cage. Oh, Gamescom. Okay, uh, August, right? Yeah, are they stupid? <laughs> when the bat falls, the rats rise. Bat versus rat, boy. Finally. I mean, that's already better than Suicide Squad, so. <laughs> it's already better than Suicide Squad. I am looking forward to heading back to the Arkham Bird. Give my ass. Mm. Now, it is time to update fans on a legendary fighting game franchise. King of Fighters. And no, uh, that includes me. Fatal Fury. Because I have been a fan of this series ever since one of its first iteration and have been playing World each Combat. one ever since. Smash. So, let's check it out. In Injustice 3. I think it's probably Fatal Fury. Yeah, no, it's Fatal Fury. 100%. Yeah, it's Fatal Fury. Yeah. I think there was a trailer that came out earlier today for that. Oh, wait. Isn't he from Street Fighter? Wait, these are Street... Dude, this is a Street Fighter. Wait, I'm just confused. Are they putting Street Fighter characters in? 
It's a all right. Let me shove it. We'll find out. Terry is where Terry. Wait, I'm so confused. That's Luke, obviously. And I forgot his character's name. No, I'm not okay. I'm fucked up. Oh my god, mommy. <laughs> of course she's. <laughs> Wait. Is this like a crossover fighter? What is this? Oh my god, is this gonna be um um? All right, no, it's just Street Fighter Six. Is this gonna be um? What was it? Capcom versus what? Oh, he's back! He's back! Yeah. Oh my god, <laughs> he said the hat's gonna form him back. <laughs> Wait, are they bringing him back through his hat? Wait, I'm confused. Wait, what is happening? I don't know the lore. <laughs> Is it grab him out or I, I don't know? <laughs> is that, is that, is that, <laughs> Bison's back. Oh, I get you. Okay, May. Yo, they're bringing May into Street Fighter Six. I might or my is it May or my? Whatever. I I've stared at pictures of her throughout years. Okay, <laughs> that's cool. I, it was SNK, right? That's uh, Capcom versus SNK. Wow. Okay, that that confused the shit out of me, bro. Oh no, another Horizon game. They turn Aloy into a man now, though. That's that's a bad idea. No, no, I only got a couple of hours into Penny's Big Bird away. I need to go back to. Huh? There's some DNA that hey, I was thinking of. <laughs> For Scotland! Oh, never mind. I'm dead. <laughs> I take it back. Not for Scotland. Yeah, don't get me started on Braveheart. <clears throat> they have spears long as men. Some men are longer than others. <laughs> Scotland forever! Watching this with Gore is better than day. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, is the audio a little too low? I feel like I'm a little too loud. Here, I'm going to crank it up a little bit. Oh, uh, yeah, Scotsman from Samurai Jack. Oh, yeah, that'd be sick. Roguelike co-op hack and slash. Tier is it tears or tears? Tell me. It's a bit low? Okay. It turned up a little bit. I'll try to keep an eye on it. I think they mix their audio pretty well. Hey, let's go, baby! Sorry, when I get loud, it's just gonna be... Alright, say October. Because there's totally not 45 other games coming in October. <laughs> Yeah. Place say September. Boo! Hey, boo! Hey, <laughs> fuck, curl it up. Turn that motherfucker to dust. <laughs> Yeah, 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 teleport him away. No matter what it's All right, so they're just straight up. Oh. Oh, you can like make different choices. Wait, whoa, whoa. So you can make like different choices and stuff? What? Wait, what? I'm sorry? He <laughs> was saying it's the what? Oh, this game looks so good. Yo, Nappa. Yo, make Nappa a Super Saiyan. It's Jiren, right? That's his name. I never watched Super, so. Yeah, I was gonna say October 11th. Wait, that's the same day as um, sup something. Is that the 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 metaphor? There you go. Fuck. Yeah, we got your release date for Spark. Yeah, Zero, finally. October there you go. 11th. Now we step into the world of Delta Force uh, Hawk Ops. Thank a you. Free to play tactical shooter available. What to the play fuck was the name? <laughs> Hawk Here's Ops. At their multiplayer FPS Hawk Ops. Extraction mode. Uh, I, wait, did I watch gameplay for this before? Team, Delta Force Rally, Hawk Ops. We've got a new mission. Where has the boob? All right, Operation yeah, Lightning Strike. We should do a collab case set. Situation at zero. <laughs> Why world in hamburger? Why are you put that? The conflict What does that mean? Have a core in Alsara Guard. What do you mean? You just wait till Silk Song appears here. But it won't. It, it might be at the Xbox thing. You never know. We need to utilize terrain for stealth insertion. Execute. Uh, probably not. No Silent Hill. I'd, I'd be surprised, honestly. But maybe, you never know. Looks like someone beat us to it. 
We need to pick up the pace. Whoa, this looks wait, hold on. This looks unique. Go, go, go. Clear the area. Is is the frame rate the stream or is it the game? Oh my god! I got a flamethrower. Yo, bring back Army of Two. That was a fun series. Well, until it wasn't, I guess. The third one sucked balls. But, you know, whatever. The second one was fun. <laughs> I was just thinking about that because they were flanking the guy. That was like the big thing about that game. Aggro, everybody. All clear. Prepare for decoding. Prepare for decoding. For a second, I thought there was another three. sniper elite. No. Uh, what's the other one? Sniper Ghost Operation Warrior? Let's see that. Good luck. Yeah, I've never seen a game like this before. Definitely not called Delta Force either. But that <laughs> is not all. The game's <laughs> premium campaign mode, Black oh. Hawk Down, is a reimagining of oh. the original game that is also fully licensed to recreate moments from the award winning Ridley Scott. Yeah, the movie. movie. Oh. Here oh. is your world premiere first look at that gameplay. Okay, I haven't seen that movie in fucking years. I remember loving it though. Yeah, is Josh Hartnett going to be in this? Get him back. Yo, he, he's. he's Wait, Josh Hartner was in the original movie, right? <laughs> I think it was. Yeah, I do remember the original game. I never played it, I don't think. Why are they burning tires? RPG! Oh, watch out. Hold on. Uh, you missed some good stuff. Oh, There's been some banger announcements for sure. I, I would recommend just going back, though. Secure and capture a team in your if you want to see them, because it's better to down, see it than just be told by some asshole like me. Yeah, look at that frame rate. It's a development build. I maybe maybe that's a stream. I did I did flash my nipples. I had to bring the camera really low. I have really low nipples. Yeah. And now my nipples are I have an update for you on Fatal Fury City of the Wolves. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought we were seeing earlier. You should have <laughs> why didn't they Yeah, I was gonna say. Okay. That's really weird that they didn't show that earlier. <laughs> oh, is Street Fighter characters gonna be in this? That'd be funny. Or when are you throwing it back on stream? I would, but it'd cause a an earthquake. What the fuck is this horror trailer? Okay, I get it. I get it. It would it would cause catastrophe. <laughs> They did not show Capcom versus SNK. Instead, SNK characters are going to be in um, Street Fighter VI. Uh, remind me, May is a Fatal Fury and also King of Fighters character, right? Because they go hand in hand a lot of times, right? Oh, this game looks good. No, this is Fatal Fury. They're they're they're, they're close together, right? Ooh, mini games. Early next year, okay. Halo. Halo. Is this a? Uh... Whoa! Wow, this guy's already a better Master Chief than the live action fucker that we have in the show. He's acting like Master Dude. This guy's had Master Chief's mask on or helmet, whatever. Longer than fucking uh, Pablo Escobar, whatever his name is, from uh, from the Halo series. <laughs> nice milkers, we won, guys. <laughs> Thanks, bro. I know you're not talking about me, but I'll pretend. Or maybe you are. That's an expensive monitor. <laughs> Uh, damn, 260 people watching? What's up, babies? Yeah, it would be nice. Cortana, jack me off. Oh! <laughs> this cute-ass looking game. Cortana, jack me off. Oh! Oh, yeah, that's good. You can, hey, you can get Steve Downs, the, the voice actor for, uh, for Master Chief, to pretty much say anything you want on Cameo, so... You can get him to do that bit. <laughs> get for game stayed for gore. Hell yeah. What is happening? I don't know. Anime. This is kind of. This is kind of adorbs. <laughs> Check off the mainframe. Jarvis, come. <laughs> Jarvis. Jarvis, I need you to jerk me off right now. 
Well, sir, I... <laughs> Dude, no, I don't have hands. I don't know. <laughs> what was the game that looked like Pokemon but Pokemon World with really good graphics? Uh, Power World? Are you type of Power? Or you're in the game? No, I'm not. Whatever they showed, that's not me. Is that the big guy? I assume. Maybe you meant the skinny one. Yeah, it's Power World. They think of Battle Crush. Alright. Oh, 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 hey, wait, what, what is this? I was about to say, those names look familiar, but I couldn't, like, pinpoint them. Are they like Gundam guys? Jarvis, give me coffee. I'll torture you. <laughs> the suit gets tighter and crushes your balls. <laughs> ah! Uh. Game about die like that about gods? I have no idea. Maybe. It's funny when a game about gods dies, though. If you really think about it. Activate freak set. Uh, turn on freak mode. Mm. Let's roll out. Yeah, maybe they'll show that Transformers game. That's possible. The <laughs> gay isn't homosexual. <laughs> like, I like all these uh, Arkham. It's Mecha Break! No, it's not Armored Core, silly. It's Mecha at Break. Summer Game Fest, and that was a look at Mecha Break with its immersive aerial and ground combat with lightning fast maneuvers. Next, no, Jason Blum and his Blumhouse. Oh, here it is! Become synonymous here it is! Incredible horror films over the years, like Get Out, Megan, and last year's Five Nights at Freddy's. Well, now Blumhouse is entering the They're video game world. They're making a game. It's called Five Nights at Freddy's. They're making a game based on the movie Five Nights at Freddy's. Okay, Halloween! Halloween, 100%. Wait, no, it looks cartoony. Okay, alright. The black phone, okay. Maybe it's gonna be everybody. All their characters in one game. A Dead by Daylight with Blumhouse characters. The, the Nun? Did they do that? You know, okay. Crisis. Chrysal Theater of Idols, okay. No, it's just a new thing. Okay. Oh wait! Oh, oh oh oh! Okay, more games. Watch out! Grave seasons from Perfect Garbage. Okay. I cannot sleep. I cannot sleep. I must not sleep. Sleep awake from eyes out. Okay. Fight to sleep. Damn, this is all original and stuff. I am okay. To death to stay awake. This has got to be one thing that's based on one of their Don't movies, worry, eh? Viv. If any ghosts actually show up, Luigi? I'll protect you. Uh, fear the spotlight. Okay. I was gonna say, what was that one game? I mean, one movie. Uh, talk to me, but that that was a hand. That wasn't Luigi. The local police department asked me to help with a case. Oh, that was a twenty-four though. Anyway, so never mind. Why would they need a game designer? The simulation. Wow. The God damn. All right. They got a lot. Oh, that's scary. No, 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 no. Oh, oh. So you're a game designer working on a game. Okay, that's kind of cool. Oh, Sam Barlow, nice. Oh, Bray, oh, my. All right, Project C. Hey, I like Brennan Cronenberg. Okay. Okay. All right. Hey. Yeah, the games look better than the movies. Yeah, that's that's probably no. That's not even probably true. Uh, all those or imaginary. I bet every one of those games costs the same amount. To make as the imaginary movie did. All combined. Please welcome Jason Blum, CEO oh, and founder okay. of Blumhouse, and Luis Blaine, creative lead at Blumhouse Games. Boo! No, I'm just kidding. Bring Steve Blum out. No relation. Yeah, some of those games look hey pretty guys, good. So we got ourselves a full slate there. But I need to see more. So, so Jason, I guess a about, better look uh, at all those. Why did you want to get into games like this? What are we doing? They might well, still do it. Been, uh, they might very, make very a game busy. based on one of their movies. Um, I have a feeling they might Thank announce something else us. at the Thank end here. Thank you guys all. Great to hear uh, the fans out there. And some with uh, Brendan Cronenberg and, and Sam Barlow. You'll, you'll all be Project very Steve. happy to know we're working at this very Five Nights at Freddy's. On the sequel of Five Nights at Freddy's. It's coming. Woo! Don't worry. Maybe anyway, this time we'll, you know, is, uh, 
Eh, never mind. <laughs> to my great relief. Two hours. Getting These are more usually two more hours. more popular. Our movies are working. It's working on streaming. It's working in live events. And we wanted to Where's try Happy Death Day 3? Our approach. Jason Cohn. To movies and apply it to games. <laughs> that's how and simple that's my humor is. Here. We're going to do that. independent games. We're going to look for creators Actually, and subtitles? give them a platform and, and encourage that. these creators to oh, be weird go. and subversive and find the most effed up, scariest right, things Maybe they not. Can They're already fucked up. Put them into really cool <laughs> games. Does anybody need those? <laughs> Well, they, they look they look great. It's a really diverse, cool slate. Uh, Luis, tell us a bit about we saw Black a bunch of Black Movie was delayed on Xbox. Kind of I'll get on again. PS5 then. Fuck Actually, it. Just so from our slate, our horror games are a lot like Blumhouse movies. They come in many different flavors of fear, which means there's a horror game for Freddy everyone. So maybe you're a fan of nostalgic 90s experiences with a bit of a twist, <laughs> intense first-person shooters. Or maybe, Jeff, you just want some bonus That marker. first game was the and most exciting one for me. That looked like a, a straight-up horror think, game. You know, we, as horror fans, we know that there are so many different subgenres. Gave me a painkiller vibe a little bit. And our Not independent really, development partners, they feel the same, and they're just as Not excited, which What's means we've got psychological nightmares, Clive Barker's we have dying. supernatural scares, we have cosmic horror. <laughs> and our team has worked really hard to work with global These creative These are jokes, by the way, before someone partners. watches this later and on and says sexism and shit. We really want to... I just spilled over myself. As we're working in indie projects, yeah. which means that we can take risks. They take your time. We can be flexible. It, the show's so two hours. Can you can it, sit down. Chill out. Storytelling and we're we so ain't fucking doing anything. Yeah, no, it, it looks, looks Games awesome. are dumb anyway. Fuck it. There, and I know... <laughs> You know, we'll get into <laughs> when games are coming like, out. But games are dumb. Take your time. Soon, Jason, it's right? all we stupid. Well, yeah, we're on, uh, we're on PC and console. And, um, and uh, yeah, we wanted to start with, uh, with not just damn. one, but we wanted to start with a few games. So, uh, so you want to you tell us about those? Yeah, so Fear the Spotlight is our first release oh, okay. coming later this ones. year. And it really hits our mission statement. It's an amazing 90s horror experience. It's got great characters, a compelling narrative. It's also super creepy. Which one was that again? I wish they were showing gameplay it. for that, because there was a lot too many there to remember all the names. Quickly, actually, Fear the Spotlight is getting its first trailer as part of the yeah. Day of the Dev Showcase. Oh. So stay tuned after the show. Directly after. Okay. Awesome. Well, okay. I know this is just the start, so we'll probably be seeing you in future years with more. I do want to see Melga Solid. What do you think of the slate? Pretty amazing. Uh, right? She's just nervous. Jason, Luis, thanks so Jason, much. get the fuck off the stage. Game. Thank you, guys. All right. And the other one. You both, and both now, get out. here's the world premiere of a brand new Power Rangers game with a retro feel. What? Why'd you spoil it? Just fucking get to the trailer. <laughs> I hate that. Just go. <laughs> Why would you do that? Stop it. <laughs> So I got hyped for when fucking songs started playing. Uh, maybe this would be better than the last beat em up game that came up for Power Rangers, which was dog shit. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! Wait, did they say who's making this already? This isn't Shredder's Revenge, guys, right? Nah, it doesn't look as good. <laughs> Make my monster grow! Yes! Go, go, Power Ranger! Oh, this is definitely getting me flagged, bro. Oh, I'm fucked. Go, go, Power Rangers! Mighty Morphin Power Ranger! Maybe they got Mike Patton for this also. Like they did for the Game and Tease song. Dude, these anime sequences are great! Whoa! What? <laughs> nice! That's great. Yeah, look at the hit the screen. That's great. Dude, this reminds me of a beat em up I played for Power Rangers when I was a kid. I think I had 3D sec sections too, if I'm, if I'm right. Rita's we re rewind. All right, nice, sick, hell yeah, fuck yeah! I'm a grown man. I'm ready. Yeah, there, there was an SNES one that was like that. Oh, I played that when I was a kid. That was like one of the first games I think I've ever played. Uh, yeah, I'm sure you could probably before he eats me. Yeah, sure. I fly. Yeah, it's rewind time. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Oh, by the way, I shouldn't have mentioned this before. If there is a movie trailer, I'm going to have to put uh, the the copyright text. I know that's probably going to piss somebody off. But I'm just warning everybody, if uh, there's a trailer for a movie, this is going up. <laughs> so, just going to give you a fair warning right now. Yeah, this is a, a tonal shift. But this looks good. I like this. Boy and his animal. Sex of his partner. 
I didn't even play one or the eight. Top reach up here. Say what do do? Rating so far? 7.5. Pretty good showcase so far. We'll see, I feel like the Keeley showcases kind of lose steam in the second half. That was a JoJo reference. Someone says Zawaru though, and maybe that's why. I oh, I do this deep boy. <laughs> I was like, what? It's deer and deer and boy. That's a good title, actually. <laughs> what a beautiful Got game, straight Deer to and Boy, which comes from first-time developer Jason Houdet in Paris, who started that project alone in 2020 during the pandemic mm, and now okay. has a team of eight helping him realize his vision. With Jojo the will come back. The French government I knew, I knew right when I did that, I'd show, have like one or two. First-time developers a chance to I thought that's what it said, on. bro. It's All not right, my fault. Next, after a long wait, Kingdom Come Deliverance oh. 2 is arriving. <laughs> I was going to say Kingdom Hearts. This is a first-person open-world action RPG from Warhorse Studios. I would only do that if you put the dollar sign in the right place, Jester. But you didn't, so Best sad. laid plans of men don't always come to fruition. Dude, the first game is so intense. Man proposes. So. Very but intense God game. Disposes. Actually, I just realized. Hold on. And then boots you right in the balls. <laughs> Cover a little These bit of the screen there. Fellas, there I need to find them. One's a smart ass smith, and the other's a blue blooded fledgling. You oh, behave like a spoiled brat. You just How punch him when he had a helmet on? Oh. <laughs> Gentlemen, praise be to our Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father. There are many sinners in this world. Oh, hey, hey, oh, 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 oh. all right, now I'm in. In the end, we all face your <laughs> He was in too. <laughs> for what we should have done. Milady. But lacked the courage to do. The last time I ran away, I lost everything. Yeah, the, the first game is, is, again. is very, it's a very grueling oh, game for my play. And I only played it for a few hours. Is this retribution for my sins? Yes. You're fucked. <laughs> His kingdom coming in her. Hell yeah, bro. Yeah, the, the combat is fucking tense in the first game. Like, every every motherfucker you fight is like, it feels like a boss battle. <laughs> to the fucking task. Alright, uh, November. Oh, they don't have a date yet. Okay. It is coming this year, though, so. Alright. It looks really good. Next, we step into the dark mind of Silent Hill creator Keiichiro Oh, Koyama Slitherhead. Uh, back in 2021, game, yes. he announced his new game, oh, Slitherhead, at the Game Awards, and now we're giving you a look at the gameplay. Yeah, it does look better, too. Tokyo like, the original game looked fine. I, I didn't think it looked bad or anything. It looked pretty, pretty solid for the most part, considering what it was. It looked pretty good. Yes, I would. Jester. Okay, Slitherhead, this is a... We better see a fat slit. It's from the side, okay. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the hell? Oh. Oh, oh! So we play as the creature thing? So he just jumped up. What the hell happened to that guy? Ew! Put that back inside you. What's wrong with you? You're disgusting. You're gross. Oh, so... What, what? So we're... Okay. <laughs> this is not what I was expecting from the Silent Hill guy. Okay. Wow, okay. I mean, the, the first time we saw it, there was a little bit of action, so I was expecting it to be an action game more so than a survival horror, but this is definitely different than I was in. Oh, it, I almost secure a bike slide. Ugh, the enemy designs, I don't like it. 
There's a lot happening there. Dude, these enemy designs are fucking terrifying. Uh, you could, uh, so it's like a better mind jack. Anybody ever play mind jack? Oh no! Oh, 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 that's sick. All right, I like that. I like it reattached your coat too. <laughs> whoa, whoa! The animations are a little iffy, but uh, this looks, wow, this looks, all right, this looks wild. Oh, you can be a doggy? Can you pet yourself? Slitterhead, that's why it's called Slitterhead also, I guess. It does look a little clunky, but you know what? Hey, November, it, why not? Yo, what? <laughs> I never thought we'd see Killer Bean here, what? Why not come out like a week and a half early and get into October? Let's... Whoa! I never thought we'd see Killer Bean here. I never thought this would ever happen. What? That's what I call a dramatic entrance. <laughs> There's Hell a yeah, reason bro. why I'm called Killer Bean. Cause you're, you're... It's because I'm good at what I do. Really? What? <laughs> is that really an ability? Really? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That dude. That's straight up from the uh, from the animated movie, which I've only seen through reactions. From the Shadow Agency, <laughs> an international organization powerful enough to shape the world, until they lied to me and tried to kill me. Now. I'm gonna destroy them. <laughs> this game looks way better than it has any right. Who wants to take down the Shadow Agency? <laughs> well, it is sure nice to meet you. Before you die. I like that you can go back first and third person. Not as, uh, more games need to do that. <laughs> I love the rag though. Yo, give him the hands, bro. Yo, switches as fucking killed Bean, bro. <laughs> Break dance shit. <laughs> Whoa! Zombies? Dude, this is. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> they made me Whoa! Me, and what I the hell? Pay for it. Oh, you have to like. Summer, okay. Okay. Cumber Bean. I would never well, guess we'd ever see that. One. That was Killer Bean, a third person roguelike shooter. Made Roguelike. by another single developer, yeah, believe same. it or not, yep, right yep, here yep. in Los Angeles, yep. Jeff Liu, who previously Jeff Liu. worked as an animator on movies like The Matrix. Matrix, yep. yep. Um, so fun. He it's said amazing everything. what can happen <laughs> in the industry. All right, to introduce their brand new game, please welcome from the Game Bakers, a small independent studio in Montpellier. That wasn't France, announced. That was Audrey already. The Prince and Emmerich Toa. That was shown before. Hello, Jeff, everyone. I'm very Hello. happy to be here. When we created our studio, Emmerich and I, we promised each other to Maybe. always we'll uh, come up with something new. Well, so after Haven. Fury and Haven, we oh, they did Fury? our new game. Oh, Haven. they did Haven. I still won't play that. Climber. About the two, the couple that When I was a teenager, hired and or my something. dad prepared an expedition to Mount K2, but half of his team Good didn't come back. And oh. I've always wondered why do alpinists risk their lives in such extreme conditions? Oh. This is something we wanted to explore. Was her dad uh, one Karen. of them that didn't make it? Uh, Karen is a game about like what it takes woman. to go beyond your limits. You climb <laughs> a mountain to reach a summit never reached uh, before. And the climbing gameplay is a challenge. Again, this is jokes. It's very Everybody's intense joke. and realistic. It's a face right, maybe, maybe not. Maybe some people are being sexy. I'm not really sure anymore. <laughs> and what you're going to see in the trailer is not from cutscenes. It's the actual climbing gameplay. You can see more later today during Day of the Devs, but now let's have a look. Okay, well... <laughs> well... <laughs> so this is just full on gameplay, right? This is a... Ew. I want to see your toes. Gross. I'm not into feet. I'm not. I'm not into them. Not into your feet. Oh, okay. So this is like a like a like a co-op style. Not a co-op. Like a, I guess like Octodad or something. You have to like control each limb. Okay. Oh no! You're fine. Man, this looks tense. Oh, 
I don't know, I just don't do full let's play though. I got I, I do too much other stuff to do full let's plays also. Oh that's a nice shot. Yeah, probably wish you didn't fuck. Me. Hey, come. On. You're gonna create an avalanche. You'll do that. Car. Okay. Starting to think maybe we should have stayed home. <laughs> Fucking watched uh, another season of Breaking Bad. I'm not meant to be here. Oh, Stanley Parable. Oh shit. I'm what? a fighter. I'm meant to be in the arena, in combat. But instead, yeah, that's what it I'm out like here in me. the middle of the woods, Look running Stanley a tea Parable shop. Guy. So, what does running a tea shop involve? This is not what I was expecting well, from the Stanley Parable people. Gardening. Next. And I've had to get used to the pretty unique tea machine they've got here. None of these tasks are all that hard. They just take patience. And I'm not really the patient type. But I'm surviving. Of course, I have to actually serve the tea to our customers. And once that's done, <laughs> I'll usually check in with Boro, the guy who owns the shop, Boro? to see if my help is needed anywhere. Boro. And when all the chores are done, we are officially I'll halfway through the show, by the way. And do absolutely nothing. It's not fighting, but it's peaceful. And what's weird Jesse's is that I actually good. feel good. I'm happy. No, I no Joseph Ferris yet. No Sonic, no, stop. uh... Transformers. I can stop. I can stop. Okay, okay. I, I was, this I was... is good for me. I need to enjoy this. Alright, here we go. This is what I was more expecting. I'm happy. I'm happy. <sighs> the game's called Alta. There's no way it's on there. Okay. Alright, now I'm interested. Yep. Wonder stop. Alright, you got me. I wanna know what the hell that's about. That was Wonderstop, the announcement of the next game from David Girl Redding, losing the her mind. creator of the Stanley Parable. Yeah. I sense where's the funny narrator? As you would expect from him and Ivy Road. Cannot wait to play that. Yeah. All right, now here's a look at the story trailer for Unknown 9 Awakening, a narrative oh, action-adventure game. game that tells the story of this. Haruna, a young woman born with the ability to venture into the fold, <laughs> the dimension. They're coming later. Sonic will be here. I confirmed it. I, I asked him. He said he's going to show up. Turn he's a little late. inward and focus on your shade. Yeah, this game looks all right. We'll see. I do. Your progress is impressive, <laughs> She's so depressive. She's, she's stupid. These are incredible. What's up, Blake? They called themselves the Sahin. Nine among them were chosen and shielded from death. The unknown nine. Does this have anything to do with why Vincent is here? Humanity has lived for eons at the mercy of the nine. It's time we took control of our own destiny. Is this? I don't know. It, it, it's. It. Why are you so interested in Vincent, anyhow? He killed someone. I'm assuming this is a low-budget thing, right? Remember stepping. Find your target. Yeah, because animations are not great. You don't belong from the here. character models. You're wrong. This is exactly where I'm meant to be. I'm assuming this is a low budget. Another game where you can take over people's bodies, though. That's fun. I don't remember that. Undone Nine's like a whole the thing, I think, right? Place. Go, shoot, you go it's a strange place. It's down there. It's a game I don't play. Okay. Yeah, isn't it like Undo Nine like a whole brand of games? That's what it's called, then, I guess. This is like the first one. Oh my god, Monster Stories! Have something. Something that I want to protect. <laughs> Screaming for dimes. Adventure stars. <laughs> okay, no problem. No problem. Where's the good stuff go? I don't know. Don't ask me. Look, buy these games. They're cheap now, I guess. Wait, why is Resident Evil 4 only 25% off, but Street Fighter 6 is fit? What the hell is this? Jima? Jama. 
Cinematic safe house, okay. Oh, did he say Metal Gear's not gonna be here? I, I, I would, I would have bet it would be here. Maybe we have uh, uh, Microsoft. Delusion I don't even know. If it's... No. Walks into my great it probably won't actually. <laughs> He's like, uh, what? <laughs> Wait, hold on, I was just playing. Feel honored to fight a legend. And of course, shot his thing and then launched him. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, he just did that too, you silly. He forgot. Yeah, yeah I, I, I heard about um, uh, Kingdom Hearts not being here. That's the only clip I've seen from that. Oh my god, you're a little jester boy. All right. So all these people just look like this. It's not armor. It's just hello. I have his face now. Bye. It's official. You suck. Where is but one certainty in the cosmos? And Atreya, the last song. Okay. That's a that was a pretty good trailer. I like that. Until now. All right, we're back here live for more Summer Game Fest. The first Descendant, powered by Unreal Engine 5, is a next-gen oh, yeah. looter. Oh, is this the girl, the one with the girl, gameplay, girls in A grappling hook mechanic. It yeah, is it's just, finally set for show release, me lazy. And we're very happy here. To I'm a horny, the show me lazy. And the reveal of the release date. I got everyone in chat horny, are they? Yeah. Yeah, you're probably right, actually. It's... Just put a... Oh, I know this song. Yeah. Oh, this song. I've heard this song in forever. Wait, is this the one I'm thinking of? I see a crack. Yeah. Or Marcello loves you. Shut. <laughs> PP still down. Got any emergency butt right now for that PP? Break glass for emergency porn. Yo, they like hiding the butt, bro. Bullshit. Stop it. You fucking showed it in every trailer for this game. That's the only reason why I remember anything about this game. <laughs> yeah, I. Th there's gonna be people later that watch this and go, wow, this guy's immature and his chat's stupid. <laughs> I mean, they're not wrong. <laughs> So yeah, is this going to be like a like a Warframe except with more waifus? I mean, it, it, the gameplay for this looks pretty solid. I'm not gonna lie. This is actually not a bad trailer, like legit. I think this music's doing a lot of uh, heavy lifting there. The first ascendant, mid frame. <laughs> But it has waifus in it, so I don't know. Wait, are there waifus in Warframe? I didn't think about that. Shit. Joe, oh, wow, that's that's really soon. I didn't know that. Did they already announce that date, or did he say they're announcing that? That looks awesome. The first Descendant will be available <laughs> across PlayStation, Xbox, and Steam. Wishlist it now and prepare for the release on July 2nd. Oh, is it not free now, to play game? Please welcome two developers whose hit indie game Among was, Us was... took the world by storm and a couple of game Among awards. Us 2? <laughs> From Inner Sloth, here are Victoria Tran and Forrest Willard. <laughs> I just hear someone yell Victoria Tran in the air. <laughs> Hello. Oh, no. <laughs> Among Us. Among Us. What's up, gamers? Yo, what's up, gamers? 
<laughs> What's up, gamers? Can you believe they just let us be on this stage? Like, no chaperones. Yeah. Like, yeah, because especially when totally I do this. Oh, do you, do you like, think they'll let us do that? Among Us 2? Among Us 3? 4? Oh, yeah, do Among right. Us 4. Well, turns out we actually have something very real we wanted to outside. present to you all today. Uh, there's been so many great indie games in recent years, but it's also been oh, yeah, no, name se five. no secret that it's they kind also. of a rough time in the industry. Some yeah. devs don't really get the chance they deserve, so we thought we could help out a little bit. That's cool. why we're excited to announce our side project, Outer Sloth, an indie yeah. game fund we made. I was just about to say, why, why no Outer Sloth earlier? Back in our less I should have said it. Days. God damn it. This is our way of saying thank you to our crewmates, players, peers, by helping some games Whoa, and look, devs have the funding and freedom needed to ship their it. games. And then we all get to play them, which was the real plan. I... I really want games. <laughs> Outer Sloth is our passion project and dream for a better, more sustainable industry. It is nice. We are I like really everybody else like, oh, so, 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 and more cover content. And incredibly nervous no. <laughs> to reveal it here and show you the current lineup of games we've managed to fund. Yeah, where's Big Mode? And don't worry, Jeff, it has your favorite, a ton of world premieres. Enjoy. Oh, oh nice. World premiere. No problem. Hey, Among Us is still fun. They they do need to do like another game though. I mean, I know they have the VR stuff, but I feel like I was talking about when they're still really here with the game. Hi, I'm Ian from Shapeshot, and you may already okay. be playing our first game, Mars First Logistics. I'm not sadly. I'm sorry, bro. I failed Near you. Trinket Studios. Oh, uh, Battle, Battle Chef for game. Yeah. Battle oh, Battle RPG. Suit Aces. Okay. Battle Suit Aces. It's a different game. Okay. I, I really like Battle Chef for game. And we are making the Marsfield Archives a game about building and exploring connections. Hi, okay. we're Midnight Munches. We just released the demo for one like of the stage. bosses. I got a new game. It's called With Gore Saves the World. I didn't make it, and I'm not ever gonna make hey, it. But fuck, you can't take the next guy off the stage. This is Rogue Eclipse, our epic spaceflight action roguelike, where you will have to customize and master your starfighter, take on merciless armadas, and vanquish a fleet mm, of colossal super I like the flying around. That's looking pretty and we nice. we do have one more game that's very early in development. Hi, I'm Eka, creative director of Outer Loop Games, makers of Thirsty Suitors. Oh, yeah, and Thirsty Suitors. In our new game, I forgot that the world in an upgradable mech and cook up tasty dishes <laughs> for local communities. <laughs> Fight off corpos, discover new doses, corpos, recipes, and reunite with your strange loved ones for one last meal. One Project last meal. Wait, is like the same thing as life, death, is that what you're doing in Thirsty Suitors? For the soul. Did you have like dinner in that? Or am I thinking of a different game? Mommy 24. <laughs> Yeah, how come they, that's Fortnite too? Thanks, Victoria oh, and Forrest. Cool. Those Sick. all look fantastic, and I cannot wait to play them. But all of those amazing indie games aren't the only thing coming out of Inner Sloth. Did you know that there's going to be an Among Us TV show? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Sounds like you did. Yes, there's going yeah, to I be forgot an about Among that. Us TV show. Check out this sneak peek. Oh, maybe I should. All right, well, 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 I'll, I'll, I'll roll the dice on this one. Oh, CBS. All right, no, I won't roll the dice. Never mind. Sorry. <laughs> Not happening. Okay. So, is this show gonna be about them all getting murdered? Oh, there's no voices yet. <laughs> what the hell is that? Dude, that looks like a game Smiling Friends would make up. <laughs> Heck, that's cool. That's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> We're not dead. That's nice. Yeah, he will be. Oh my god, Pat Oswald, the, 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 Phil, Phil, oh, Ashley Johnson, Deborah Wilson, she's in everything. Okay. Oh, I don't know. Oh, a lot of cast members. Up next, we have right, Sonic good. X Shadow Generations. Oh, let's go! <laughs> a definitive greatest hit collection of 3D and 2D levels from Sonic and Shadow's history. Now it's yeah. time for a glimpse of Shadow's Yo, brand new powers and gameplay from a standalone campaign, as well as the official release date announcement. Uh, uh don't say October, please. No, it's already getting packed. Okay, here we go. Dude, I'm gonna go Oh, wait, this is the final boss of Generations, right? Is it? I haven't played Generations since it came out, so I'm gonna go buy what I remember. 
Yeah, yeah, it's looking solid. Yeah, I mean, it's like about, I don't know, about the same, maybe, I don't know. All right, there we go, here's shadow levels. I wonder how much shadow content there will be. Oh my god. Uh, where's Maria? Where's his gun? Generations was very good. Yo, Metal Sonic. <laughs> I love the skating. You know? Yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. Okay, okay. Woo! Yeah, it doesn't look like it's like... I, I, I'm trying to like... Pinpoint how diff with this power. Okay. October twenty God damn it! <laughs> Too many October games already. Oh, you got to play it three days. Oh, what the hell? Terry skin? Alright. Alright. The year Go. of shadow, right? A movie coming in December oh, too. Don't say don't stuff. All right. You can't do in that. In the upcoming online survival game Dune Awakening. You can't do that! Com, there is one small decision that unleashed a chain of events. We oh, set the stage for the story child. the player will experience. Yep. Let's find out for the first time what, what that is. Oh, okay. Never mind. I thought they were going to say, why does it didn't happen? There's a future that never happened. Or maybe that's what he did say. I was too busy thinking about Shadow. I was trying to like figure One out like what's I, the difference Paul Atreides in the graphics there. Oh, this never born. Okay, so it is that. Okay, it is. All right. I created the future. Until... It created me. Long live the fighters! But I see a narrow way. Yeah, I'm sorry, movie trailer not happening. Or he's been. teasing us. No, it's not happening. It's weird. What you think it would. My mother had obeyed her orders and given Just birth me. to a girl. Oh. Well. Everything would change. <laughs> Dr. Yue exposed before his betrayal. A world where my father lives. House Atreides surviving the Battle of Arakeen. Oh, so it's all Paul's fault. Sardaukar deployed to protect the Spice Melange. The A war of just strangled in the crib. spreading across the planet. Fremen exterminated. Yeah, I need to see some gameplay. Maybe it's going to go to... No, Muad'Dib. No, Muad'Dib. No, Muad'Dib. No, Muad'Dib. No, Kwisatz Haderach. All of my visions Nick -Nick lead Paddywhack? to horror. That, Except for this one. This one leads to you. Okay. I mean, alright, cool. That was a cool trailer. I would have really liked some gameplay? Oh, okay. Yeah, I need some gameplay, bro. Especially since I'm not a big MMO More guy. I need to see it. Gamescom ONL in August. Now oh, okay. it is time to see Did the announcement of another new game right, cool. from a brand new development Stick studio. My crack. Ooh. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I like an animated trailer. I like it already. Okay. Sold already. You got me. You can only go downhill from here, so keep this momentum up. Again, multiplayer vibes, hero shooter maybe, strategy game could be also, you control your mech, or, I don't know. MOBA, <laughs> it's a card game. I love when they do animated trailers, this animation's really good too, what the fuck. Yeah, me too. I agree with hyper anime trailers are always welcome. Yes. Ooh, battle aces. All right. No gameplay. To though. tell us more about battle oh, okay. aces and show you the gameplay. Oh, here you go. David Kim from Uncap Games. Wish Dune Awakening did that. Chef. Hello. So battle aces is the RTS game for. Everyone. Oh, it is RTS it's for Fuck. players that are brand new. Yeah, I was RTS getting RTS as well vibes as from RTS it. Veterans. We no. really want yeah, to bring right. the core. Sorry, that's just not RTS personal. That's not me. Kind of like how games such as Sorry. World of Warcraft did for MMOs or Hearthstone did for card games. 
So yeah. Battle Aces is an action-packed oh, high brass trailer than this. That has a high emphasis. I mean, to be fair, this looks faster than most RTS games I see. Very specific RTS fun to players in two major ways. Oh no! Whoops. First. We want to amplify nice both try, the Winchy. in and out I'm of not RP, RTS guy. I'm sure if you're an RTS guy, you're like, yeah. What makes it very cool is not only will players be able to define the exact way that they Why are you asking for Velma Season 2? I'm not watching that shit. players will be able to experience <laughs> and end this uh, possibility of strategies. Second, I have currently arrived. Oh, there you go. Someone, someone likes it. You shut up. To play in RTS or let's just say to them, shut up. No, that's fine. So that players playing this <laughs> game are experiencing only the fun parts of playing an RTS game. So I know. I already heard about Scrappy Doo. About Battle Aces, or if you want to sign up for our beta test that's coming up very soon. How about this? Please, when uh, they officially announce it's canceled, then I'll watch the final Aces. episode. Dot com. So just so, so I could be like, this is the final thing of Velma. I'm going to watch any of the other episodes. That's fantastic. All right. Only the last episode. Our next premiere unveils the exciting new destination for a game that Shadow dropped at the Game Awards last year, The Finals, with its unparalleled oh, yeah, the destruction finals. wrapping okay. the world's most deadly game show. Now, after dozens of updates and two seasons, we're unveiling where the contestants finals will be going good. in the all-new season starting next week on June 13th. Sharpen your katanas and welcome to season three. Of the finals. Okay. It's When's the final the season? It can take us anywhere. Oh, a little funny guy there. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> uh, whoa, come on, man. I just got a little knife. <laughs> Alright, let's fucking go, bro. I don't care. <laughs> I know, pussy. Let's go. This is cool. All right. Oh my god, I can't wait to destroy this place, dude. The destruction in this game is so good. I need to play more of it. I only played the beta. Hell yeah, yo, it's just straight up samurai. I thought maybe the samurai, the, the skins would just be samurais. But oh my god, yay! Just straight up melee weapons. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> The player count is dropping. Oh no! Oh, as long as there's the enough people playing. The final is in Kyoto. All right. Please welcome multiple Game Awards right. winner and a dazzling Game Awards performer, if I do say mm. so myself. Yeah. Sam Lake from oh, Remedy. You did it. Oh my God! Here it comes. Animal Make Two DLC. Still need to fucking play it. Yeah. No, that's a oh, oh! 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 Look at him go! <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> no. I think that's enough. Thank you. <laughs> no more fucking dancing. Hi. You see, this is now the only way they let me come on stage to tell <laughs> you something exciting. <laughs> you dance? News about Alan Wake 2. Fucking dance. Oh, physical. Many of you physical, physical have copy. been posting your Remedy Game collection pictures on your shelves with Alan Wake 2 so far digital only, sadly missing. Well, we are excited to announce Finally. physical deluxe edition. Thank you. And physical collector's editions Ooh. for Alan Wake 2 coming this fall. Yeah. Copy Should have this last fucking year. Tomorrow. Oh, okay. I am a bit, I bet. I'm Next, a bit. we promised you some expansion content for Alan Wake 2. Hey, maybe I'll just right. wait until this DLC comes out. Let's I'm play it off. thrilled to introduce you all to Night Springs. Oh, oh, nice. That makes sense. All right. It yeah. contains three episodes with three familiar fan favorite playable characters in mysterious. I think it'd be fan favorites from two and or one in what if scenarios. It Control, was maybe? a chance for us to really go out there, as if we already didn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Night Springs will be playable today. Don't in less than twenty-four hours. Oh my God! Oh fuck! I guess I gotta play it. <laughs> fuck! I gotta play it. Thank you. God damn it! Now, I gotta play Malawik too. With this world <laughs> premiere, All right, is Jesse I gonna show up? You to step into Night Springs. 
the quantum break guy going to show up? Or is this going to be Alan Wake characters? All right, let's see. Night Springs. A special place. A shifting I know space. this guy. From Existing two from a countless seat. number of parallel realities. Different every time we set upon the road that leads us there. And yet, always familiar to us. In Night Springs. Okay. Yeah, everyone, I want a shit ton of awards. I'm in danger. Oh, oh, Please that's the one diner fan. girl from the first one? The yeah, number one fan. Great. <laughs> we'll come back for you. Wesker? Hey! Oh my god! Wait! Sean, I'm really happy. This is it. Hey, there she is! Yeah! Is the <laughs> Jesse. Wait, is that is that is that is that, is, that was just Sean Ashmore? It, it, from Quantum Break? Was different. That's him, right? That's his character? Not my favorite character, to be fair. Hell yeah! It's funny, because Jesse also... The actress also played Beth in uh, Quantum Break, and I think he just said Beth, didn't he? Wait, is that... That's a real shotgun? <laughs> Alright, nice. You never truly know how deep the rabbit hole goes in Night Spring. I bought the deluxe edition, so available tomorrow. Damn, on Saturday, that's crazy. <laughs> All right, cool. No. All right, that was hype. And you know what? Didn't spoil anything in the game for me, so I'll play it eventually. I mean, I played the shit out of Wake One. I did a full review for that when it came out. A cruel and beautiful paradise where primal forces. Is this arc? No, I'm, sorry. I'm trying to think what this is now. Like, Over the islands. No, no, yeah. No, Ark's the dinosaur. What was that thing? Where ancient mysteries awaken. Yeah, whatever. Fuck it. Where heroes are forged and demons. New World? Born. Maybe. I don't know. I never played New World. New World, yeah. The Amazon. Yeah, yeah, it said Amazon in the beginning. That's right, yeah. yeah. That's right. I forgot that was an Amazon book. Yeah, New World. Eternum. 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 And Night Springs brought this showcase from a 7 to an 8.5. I'm getting the vibes of like, right, what was the DLC for Resident Evil 2? The remake, the one where you Xbox play as like XS some of the side characters. October 15th, and now you can They're play probably not going to be big solo story player, things, but it's so cool. And use cross -play as well. It's if cool Jesse Faden's in on TikTok uh, live right now. Control's such a great HSR game. In the I'm waiting for, for that second game. In-game bundle for Honkai Star Rail of Stellar Jade from TikTok Game Rewards. Honkai, let's go. speaking of Honkai Star Rail, Hoyo Versus' latest space fantasy yeah, RPG just zero. concluded. It's version 2.3 special oh, program. I thought they're going to go to Endless Zone Zero. But there's more. A sneak peek at the upcoming ex expedition featuring a beloved character who is clearly ready for the forthcoming journey with her brand new look. Oh, shit. All right, let's go. Fang favorite character. Who is it? Why do people choose? To Kagome. It's because <laughs> yeah, I'm afraid. Yeah, I will be. Uh, future game show. Yeah, I think I will actually. PC gaming show. I'm, I think I will too. And the next Xbox showcase definitely. In this land of dreams. No idea who this is. Okay, maybe that's not the one that we're focusing on. I don't play this game, so. I don't even watch trailers for this game. And fade away like I will play Zenless Zone Zero when it comes out on the uh, consoles. Want to face, we'll never right. come. That's mommy material right there. I don't know what that is, but that's mommy material. Confirmed. Oh, I'm not. I'm not. I, I, who the fuck is this shit? No, I like this show so much. Gork come you want me? Yum, yum. Why do people choose Leave me to what's slumber? what's all over the screen. Come you one. You should clean that. Because in the end, I'm about to blow. <laughs> don't like don't blow. Dreams. Do not come. Do not come. I'm gonna come. Sorry, sorry to all the Hoyoverse people out there. Yeah, <clears throat> Sonic's better though. Oh my God, that new dress is kawaii. I say new because he said he had a new look. Is that her? Oh. Gotham. Oh, what is this? I just pulled the game out of my ass there. Oh, is this um, that one game people really like? Darker, darker. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
Hey, bro, it's coming up. We let them get away with making these games. Yeah, the Nintendo Direct will probably be at the end of the month. Be most worried. Thou art not alone. People love this game. I know it's looking a little clunky, kind of, but, like, supposedly that's kind of part of the charm. That's what I've heard, at least. Uh, we got 30 minutes left. Claim thou... What? I didn't read that. I assume claim thou something. Vanquish or perish. That's every game, bro. There's not a, like, talk it out option, usually, unless it's, like, a Mass Effect. Oh, maybe we'll see Mass Effect. Oh, of course I bought Switch 2. Switch 2 is mine. Uh, I don't think anything going on on Tuesday, unless Nintendo announces a Direct that day. I will be live for the Ubisoft thing, also. Yo, what's up, chatbox? Yeah, it's Dark and Darker. Yeah, it was just an ad, really. There you have it, the unforgiving fantasy FPS dungeon PvPVE adventure, Dark and Darker, what? is now live on oh. both Steam and Epic Game Store today. So oh, was it on Early live. Access? Lots of fans are joining us here in person at the YouTube Theater, and we thank you for that. And ahead of the show, four lucky Woo. fans were upgraded to our VIP section thanks to the Discover Orange Ticket upgrade. With Discover, oh, you don't have cool. to be a VIP to be treated like one. Well, who's, right, now the here's the announcement for the release date for Capcom's upcoming Kunitsugami Path. Oh, the here Gats. you go. Someone mentioned this earlier. Oh, no, it's all this crazy. You better clean it up, bro. Get off my face. Your breath is taking. Oh, really? Oh, wow. They couldn't because of a lawsuit? What? What was the lawsuit? The name or the game itself? It's Dark and Darker is kind of generic title. Uh, yeah, this game looks pretty cool. Control your little troop guys and stuff. Your little, your little wad of cum, and you just fly around. Finally, <laughs> the game made for me. Hey, whoa. I know you meant night when you put that. Womp womp. This is Zen Zoo. What is it? Zen Mitsugami or something? We've seen this before. Zen Mitsugami. Yeah, I nailed it. July 19th? Okay. It's on Game Pass, right? Did they say Game Pass in there? I remember them saying that before, I, th I think it was. Oh, hey. Oh, is this um, Hyperlight? Whatever. Breaker? Would you play a game uh, where else you shoot people behind the cameras? I don't know what that means, but yes. Chat, 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 chat. Oh, XQC in there. Chat, 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 chat. All right, I'll give XQC this. He definitely interacts with his chat better than some other streamers out there. Cheeto. What the hell are you calling Cheeto? I'm gonna, it's not me. I'm not a cheater. <laughs> yeah, I probably think. That's what I thought it was. Yeah, I just wanted to it was. It was a Baldwin reference. Well, How about Balls Way? Well, it's a fake ass uh, game beast well, game. Party beast. <laughs> Actually, what said? <laughs> I piss shit, shit piss. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that sounds like a Duke Nukem line. I piss shit, shit piss. How many people are watching this actually? Damn, look at many people watching. This is on YouTube, also on Twitch. I'm assuming it's probably more, right? I'm a cute little doggy, don't you? I know, I heard Pearly Animals is really fun. I like this little song. Ooh! A Skate 4 announcement at the end? That was sick, actually. I get hyped for that. I mean, we already know that game's coming, so. Would you eat chips? Would you eat your chips if they started talking? Yeah, really loud, too, right into the mic. We know you may have heard the stories about the fine what? people here at M Corp. So we wanted to take <laughs> what is this? time to dispel 
Tim Robinson. These completely unfounded rumors. <laughs> I still haven't finished the last and season. We Fuck. You that thinks you're an M Corp and the city of San Francisco have never been better. Things are going great. Here. Dude, that's ugly it knuckles. I mean, ugly Sonic. No, ugly from the citizens. It's a guy Everybody voice Everybody here at M Corp loves this town. We think this town rules. <laughs> Why would we hear a town that rules? I can't stop thinking about how you're saying Crap. we're selling the city for scraps. That makes me sick. That makes my whole family sick to their stomachs. <laughs> my wife hasn't been on the toilet for weeks. Because of what you're saying about what M Corp's doing to this town, all those lies. <laughs> Everyone in M Corp is really good. Yeah, you did. Stop <laughs> crying, all right? This is business. Look around, pal. This is how businesses are run. Is now this a job simulator three or some shit? Okay, Jack. Tissues, come on, pal. Ah! <laughs> come on, faster. <laughs> oh, poor guy. That's not about this. That's a, that's a father and son. That's actually a home issue. <laughs> we love it here at M Corp. And Aww. we <laughs> are not going anywhere. <laughs> we'll be here a long time. Oh. Nobody panic. What the fuck is this for? <laughs> the fuck was that for? <laughs> All right. Uh, welcome back to Summer Game Fest. And now let's head what was that to for? Sam Vansterdam for a new look at Skate from EA. What? Hey, Jeff. How you doing, bud? The oh, crap. Uh some really bad stuff's happening out there. They're gonna need a lot of help cleaning that up. What? Oh, that was a skate? <laughs> that was a skate thing. Why didn't they just go straight to that? Why didn't they have fucking Jeff come out and say, we're still working on it. God damn it. <laughs> that was the weirdest and out. All right, uh, skate by the way. Why didn't you just go right to the next clip? <laughs> or, or say, oh, that's weird. What is this about? Check this out. All right, it's looking good. It's looking, I mean, it's looking fine, I guess. I mean, it's looking like a skate game. Yeah, aren't they doing the thing where you can, like, actually test it with everybody? It's just good we call skate. That's not playtesting this fall. Okay. All right. It looked good. It looked good. I mean, hey, I love Tim Robinson. Very so exciting never... that people will finally be able to play skate. On no, no, I'm okay with that. That that trailer with him in it. I was just weird that it brought, brought back, it went back to Jeff and he's like, and has oh, anyway, skate. Million players yeah. worldwide. That was weird. That's right. I'm talking about Pal World. I mean, just look at the giant depresso. Cheer up, buddy. It's Summer Game Fest. <laughs> now, here's the first major fuck. update. You don't know what's going through his mind. A whole new island is coming. Wow, that was very insensitive for the little depressed fuck. I still have barely played this game. That's you, Gordon. No! Actually, it is. Okay, big update coming. Oh, new island. A whole new island, eh? Alright. Dude, this, this game blew up so much bigger than I ever thought it would. I mean, I know the player count has dropped significantly. That guy looks like a Pokemon for sure. Uh, wait, is this a game like Pokemon? Xbox, the kids are nice. I didn't know that that was not there. Ooh, new level cap. Okay. So they like. Wait, what does this new subspecies mean? Like a. Is, it, is that like an evolution thing? I'm sorry? <laughs> An oil rig? Was this Microsoft 5? <laughs> it was an oil rig, but you know. Oh, they put arena. Wait, no, no, no. They already, they already, they already confirmed that. They had that before. I remember that. Never mind. Ooh. Can't wait to beat the hell out of you. I'm gonna shoot you up with my guns. <laughs> I'm gonna shoot you with my gun. I'm gonna shoot you with my gun. I'm gonna shoot you with gun. Oh, I'm gonna shoot you again. Right. Take your Pokemon go to Steam charts, fucking war. Uh, congrats to uh, Power World on the new update. Next up, we've Why got a big announcement from Steam Valorant. Shirts. Here's Andy Ho and Anar Gilfeson from Valorant. the Valorant dev team. Guys. Yeah, this game still sucks. <laughs> and move on. No, I'm just kidding. Thanks, Jeff. 
Hey everyone, since 2020, we There's have been Jeff. fortunate to serve players in their pursuit of what we call the <laughs> Valorant moment. The big plays and clutches you make Mitterrand. while all eyes are on you. Pokemon Genocide, they should all call the, the next one that. Awesome. Have earned their own Valorant moments on PC. And today, the stage is set to welcome a whole new group of players. Oh boy. Let's take a look. Wait, oh, oh wait, hold on, does that mean, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. We're a whole new group of kids. What does that mean? <laughs> Target down. Wait, hold on. I mean, I'll suck at this game either way, even if it's on consoles, but I will be more willing to give it a whirl. <laughs> Get this Garbado screen. Here, I can help a little bit. There you go. You don't see all of it. <laughs> Only 80% of it. No, Silk Song was not shown. Actually, I'm lying. Silk Song was shown and it, it came out already. It came out last week, actually. Okay, just get to the last one. All right, we know what the game is. They, they're doing this just because it's coming to consoles. There's no way it's not. It would. All right. Well, thanks for the confirmation there. No, no more spoilers for leaks, though, please. Someone said it was leaked. That could be bullshit, though. You never know. All right, just fucking tell me. God damn it. <laughs> this game's been out for four years. <laughs> we know. All right, to be fair, I think that's a new character in the show. I assume. Like. Uh -uh. All right, that's cool. I've been wanting that for a little bit. Yeah, that's a new character. Series X, free limited beta now? What do you mean free? Yeah, it better that fucking be free. was Valorant's core <laughs> tactical gameplay. Everything you just saw was captured on console and long. with a controller. Valorant is coming to PlayStation 5 oh, and okay, Xbox so Series X and S June 14th? this year. Our limited beta starts June 14th, right. and you can sign up Wait, right now Xbox at beta.playvalorant.com. No, this is like so three years ago. Oh, okay. Your input Damn. To make sure <laughs> That's a that really Valorant delayed is great on leak. <laughs> and we hope to see you soon in the limited beta. It's a really but long. Why did it take that long? Head of Valorant Studio, Anna Donlin. Oh. Thanks, guys. Hey, everyone. Sup, fuckers? One of my favorite things about Valorant has been seeing the community build the game and the sport right along with us. For the last four years, we have yeah, been it's, it's, it wasn't out on a bringing Valorant to consoles. That was an announcement. It took them a four minute trailer to tell us that. Currently, a Valorant Masters, one of our largest global tournaments and community celebration. Uh, I don't think I have. I played TF2 the though. Evolved, as new players bring their passion this noise and expression happening? to Valorant has been the biggest joy. I, I get they're in a so crowded far. place, but and now we are ready and so so excited. Why don't you just go somewhere else? A whole new group of players. It's a little quieter. Go to the bathroom. Here's so much shit. We can't wait to see where you take us. Out of it with the game, it seems like. Like from what people in the chat are saying. Okay. Hey, I really like it. Whether it's Valorant or League of Legends or whatever, I really like um, pretty much anything animated they do. Obviously, Arcane is top tier. But... What do you have people over in your background? That wasn't me. <laughs> that was the game. You know what they're saying? I don't have people over. Ew. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why we're showing this too. Five minutes of the showcase dedicated to this when it's not related to Summer Game Fest almost at all is kind of annoying. Nice. Did you forget to check the basement again? That would be very strange if I had a basement. I live in a second floor apartment. Well, way too much on this game already. Yeah. It was just announced that it's coming to Game Pass or something. Or not even Game Pass. It even said, well, why would it go to Game Pass? Isn't it free? Someone said something earlier about Game Pass. Oh my god, it was that. What's her name? Is that the Cookie Lady? Was that the Cookie Lady? Pokey. 
lady? Pokey Power World or whatever? Go Rissy, you know, you know. Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, it was Pokemon. I didn't know she even played. Uh, what was this game called again? Exciting to have Riot on console with Valorant. Thanks for the team at. Thanks to the team at Riot. Yeah, thanks for, for the team for wasting our fucking time. SGF. Our next announcement is a big deal from our friends at DoorDash. Five weeks of deals with Summer of Dash Pass. Uh, DSP just Sign got up wet. For Dash Pass now for zero dash dollar pass. delivery fees and get fifty. That's actually hard to say. Dash Pass. Or dash Pass. Now here in the okay, audience, no, we've not. got a guy who is normally co-streaming our shows, Yang Ya, who is also an amazing voice actor. No. Oh. Who's been in countless uh. games <laughs> such as uh, Like a Dragon and God of War Ragnarok. Well, next week, oh, he's going to be Ragnarok. voicing a character in a movie. Inside Out 2, where he plays what? a fictional video game character, oh. Lance Slashblade, and we've got your that's exclusive. A, that's a dumbass name, but all right. I know it's supposed to be a joke name, but even as a joke Welcome name, it's stupid. To your eternal oh, wait, shit. Fate. Oh, he even has the bad graphics. Why would you spoil this? Here, I'm gonna put this. Sorry. Actually, no, this is Disney. It'll be fun. Yeah, I always thought Riley had a secret crush on him. Well, actually, no, this would be shit. Sorry. I long to be a hero. I like, I like they have like their oh, shitty graphics best. on them. Oh, I'm in a hundred percent. We were all banished here, deemed unfit, worthless. Oh, don't you dare say that! You do not deserve to be thrown away. Uh, one second, Lance. Don't you remember his power move? I'm covered by your eyes. Oh yeah. Watch this. <laughs> I'm sorry. No one is totally worth this. Right, I, I am a warrior curse. <laughs> that was the worst. But you must make your curse your gift. Shield yourself, my friends, for I shall set you all free! <laughs> all right. All right, you got me. That's the pretty funny. The number one gaming monitor brand in the U.S., <laughs> Samsung, just released new 2024 oh, monitors for gaming, yeah. work, and entertainment. Scan the QR code to get up to $300 ball. Samsung credit when you purchase Sam is over here, bro. plus a chance to win $5,000 <laughs> Samsung credit for U.S. residents. All right, you got me. Summer Game Pass oh, oh, yeah, this is that one game. Look at all of you cooped up watching <laughs> video game announcements. They got Ken Jeong back. Chicken His ass ain't doing it. Like Ken Jeong. And today, Chicken is excited to share a new game that Chicken and Chicken's buddies are in. Called uh, they gotta Star pay Buster. for the you fight the show. I guess that's why they put ads in there. Shiny things, and Chicken has a big role. That's all that matters. Yeah, it's and always the last half. I swear, it's the last yeah, half. Every time Jeff Keighley does oh, something, oh, I mean, it always like falls oh, off. Oh, yeah, you're funny. Shush, please. Oh, don't show this whole fucking thing. Do on? not. You better not show this whole thing. Who are you? Look at this. Better not be the whole fucking thing. I'm the chicken. This better not be the whole thing. It's like here, five minutes like long. I'm fine. I drink. This I drink is a this is a fun ad, but it better not be the whole thing. Definition of fun. Come on, get up. I am butt naked from the waist down. So get out of the fucking bed, dude. Get out of the bed. All right. Tell me about yourself. I, I think I'm an excellent candidate for the job uh, because. Uh, uh, because and your sword play time, but your sword play. He is a bridge. He's that, one of the most uh, equitable yeah. people I've ever met. So great emotionally. <laughs> Please be a condensed a version. And now, just a lumberjack. Just don't think you're qualified to be an accountant. So. It's like a five-minute ad. Which it better not be the whole thing. I mean, again, it was a fun <laughs> ad. <laughs> yes, that is Chris Hemsworth. If you've seen this ad, I'm sure you have. I, I hope not. That came out of me. Yes. Guys, maybe everything is enough. Squad. Activity. That also came out of him. Shit. Yeah. Whatever he was called, yeah. Gordon the movie freak. He just really loved your feet. Your your mind. That might be my name somewhere. Oh my Jack off in the meantime. I need at least ten minutes. Nine minutes is dedicated to finding the perfect clip. Instead of Raggedy, just you call this a squad? Squad, squad goals. <laughs> <laughs> You're wasting my fucking time. Jinx. Jinx. That is Dolph Lundgren, Jinx. by the way. You Jinx. Someone told me it was. Lumberjack? If a two-headed person were to make out with the other head, would that be considered incest or masturbation? Why not both? Hey, you wouldn't happen to want to go chop some trees, would you? I'd be delighted. Who is that? Who's the other guy? I'm sure it's somebody. Did they condense that down a little bit? Because I feel like it was always five minutes long. Wait, there was a scene in an elevator, so they definitely cut that out, I think. Unless it was there and I blanked that. Yeah, I think that was cut down a little bit. Yeah, I get it. You fucking shit it. 
You hear people laughing in the background. Again, it was a funny little ad. But it, it's been out for like two weeks and probably played in front of every YouTube fucking video for that long. We don't... Uh, what? Make it a 30 second ad next time. That was way All too right. long. Please join me in welcoming to the SGF stage Monster Hunter series producer. Okay. Mr. I thought they were going to bring us the team that made... Here, here's the guys that made that mobile game. Hey, thank you, Jay. Okay. Hey. Hey, what's up, man? I'm not joking. We need Cheech and Sean. Yeah, that'd be cool. I mean, they're like 80 years old, but. Ten more minutes. We gotta have one big announcement, right? Thank you, Jeff. Hello, everyone. Not that we haven't had any big ones. We had some good stuff. I want everyone to be on the lookout for a very mysterious no. large monster My near the end of the trailer, bigger. as it's an important monster <laughs> in the inside. The game. Yeah. Don't give me hope. Squirrel. Especially since that Ubisoft show is happening in a couple days. So. Oh, I got yeah, I only wait. DLC was hype. Uh, what else? There was some other good stuff. Killer Bean. <laughs> Killer Bean was pretty good. Oh, I got hiccups. That ad gave me hiccups. Fuckers. As you'll see, we're working Did you just say to deliver a gaming experience that? That, immer that merges multi -pass. immersion and action. I hope Civ 7, yeah, that's good. Lego Horizon, yeah. Across different platforms. Jailbreak Mouse when game, yeah, that looked really good. Um, Cuff Bus, yeah, Cuff Bus. On PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X and S, and PC. Oh, yeah, Sonic Generations. It might look good. Yeah, it look good. Yeah, Bill Clinton King. Like, oh, that's supposed to be fucking hilarious. Do it, no balls. And bring it to Switch. It'd be amazing. I'll play that while taking a shit. The Xbox Showcase would probably be alright. Yeah. Sparky Zero, yeah, release date of his night. I mean, there's some good stuff. I'm not gonna fucking say anything. That among us show looking pretty good. Opening night live at Gamescom in August. And our first public hands-on playable demo of Monster Hunter again. Wilds will also debut oh at God. Gamescom. Thank you. Really? Light no fire? Okay. That could be it. The No Man's Sky game. Uh, over there! I, I wish I could get into these games. I, I just, I can't. I try, really. I try with Rise. I try with World. I tried with the PSP games. I tried with the Wii U game. I just can't. And guess what? I'll probably try with this one too. I really want to because it's so sick. Dune worms. I'm sure everybody's saying that. I'll say it too. Yeah, the first half of the show was really good for the most part. I really liked it. It has dropped, and there's all been a lot more ads. Oh no! No, my chocobo! Yo, you killed my chocobo. Now I will choke a hoe. As I feared, it picked up our scent. I'll handle it. You find someplace safe. Thank you. I mean, having just a, <laughs> oh, you have to go, like go in circles to get out. That's funny. That makes sense. I mean, this looks fucking epic. Every moment. Ooh, that was my shot. Don't worry, the hunter is here. Oh yeah. Just watch. You will see what hunting is all about. <laughs> you instantly die. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, that's embarrassing. All right, is it gonna say release date, maybe? I know it's 2025, but yeah. All right, cool. Do you think there's some more Indiana Jones game? Oh yeah, they definitely will. Thank you, Riosa Sun. Maybe Spider-Man 2 at DLC at the end. In August. Maybe. That's now possible. during last year's PlayStation Showcase, the game Phantom Blade Zero. Oh yeah, this game looked really good. With its blazing fast combat and stylish art. 
Well, yeah. I'm honored to share with you the brand new trailer for the game. This game looks featuring sick. Featuring all real gameplay. Here's our final game of the show, Phantom Blade uh, oh, Zero. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. This is it. All right. This is supposed to come out this year. This is the final game of the show. Okay. Damn. No big uh, announcement at the end. All right. I mean, this game looks really sick. So. And it, was it, was this game made by one person, or am I thinking of a different game? Or like it was? It started off as by like one person, I think. I might be thinking of something. 41. The face of this is here! Don't... Don't go up there. Turn back. Oh, Before Jesus. it's too late. Yo, I got hung the horse. <laughs> what the fuck do horse do? <laughs> I with the stream itself being a little, uh, iffy. Uh, oh, yeah, 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 I like this. Oh, boy, he did horses there. I guess so. Yeah, I, I guess uh, when it comes to, like, the Souls-like type games, I'm going to be playing a couple this year. I got this, got Black Myth. That's more than I usually play. No Elden Ring trailer. I'm actually surprised by that. I thought we'd definitely get that. Oh my god. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think they showed this character in the past. I think. Lead Dancer. Or Jade Dancer. Is it? Okay. World Tour Demo. Is that out now? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, you have to actually go there. Okay. Okay. That's pretty good. S S that looks so good. Full demo that Media will be playing this weekend, so you'll hear much more about that. And that's going to do it for our Summer Game Fest live show. Thanks to Joy for joining us. Thank okay. you, Jeff. It, I had that wasn't the best trailer time. for that, I will say, Happy though. Happy Summer Game Fest, everyone. But it was pretty Thanks, good. Joy. And we have so much more, so stay tuned, because yeah, Day does. of the Devs is coming up it was right abandoned. now on the stream, featuring an hour of indie game See, reveals. Right, I'll, be, I'll be on for the uh, and that's followed Devolver, by Devolver Digital Direct. thing, now keep checking which will be in an hour. For other event streams this weekend, and we'll see you again live this August 20th in Germany for Gamescom opening night live. I Thanks wish they, watch, they should have moved like Remember, the Alan Wake the DLC at the end. That was right a very now. strange ending. That was very strange. So not full two hours, that's it. Um, I watched a little bit of this, uh, but I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go off and edit some stuff. And probably get something to eat real quick before the Devolver thing, which is always fun. All right, see ya, Captain. Hey, everybody, hey, thank you. Yeah, yeah not, the, not a great show. Not bad, though. I don't, I don't know. There was some good stuff in there. Um, Nintendo, please save us. <laughs> yeah, I would say seven out of 10. <laughs> my favorite Ferris wheel. What the hell you call me? Uh, shit just got really loud. Yeah, I'm gonna turn this up. There, there you go. Um, wait, did that make the stream a little bit less? Oh, oh, they're gonna show that game. Oh, they're just showing everything they're gonna show during this. Game. Yeah, I, I, I probably won't watch Day of the Devs, uh, but I will watch whatever. Yeah, it makes me go. Volvi yeah. will save us. Hey, legitimately, every time there's a Devolver thing, there's always some good games they show, and then the showcase itself is always funny, so. What's up, Ronan? Yeah, well, I mean, no, we have Xbox in a couple days, Ronan. Uh, that's gonna be big. Um, and then we also have Ubisoft after that, and then Nintendo has a thing, and, um, sometimes it's fun. Or short for gorgeous. All right. Any other showcases tonight? Yeah, the Devolver one. That's it. There's this also, but I'm gonna probably cut this here and then come back in like an hour. But anyway, thank you everybody that showed up. I know there's a lot of people that were here. I think it, it was kind of disappointing for some people that were alone, actually. Hey, it was weird, not one really big thing towards the end. Like, he usually likes to have something big at the end. I feel like he always does, but this time, no. Phantom Bleed Zero was cool, but like, what? That was a very strange thing to end it on. <laughs> I have to do the whole thing from the top. Very strange. I don't know. Again, cool, cool game. It was mid, but I went the best part. Hi, everybody, and welcome to the oh, Day of the Dez portion was... of the show. Day of the Dez is a nonprofit oh, yeah, organization whose team of volunteer curators totally scours the globe 
for the best video games for you to enjoy with a focus on indie developers. We ran our pocket this Sonic 3. That sucks. Today, I, I got like almost every game. prediction wrong. And, uh, <laughs> no Bioshock. No, back no, relax, no that. No anything. Summer games. No Arcane Season 2 teaser, which uh, to be fair, they they said oh, they're going to show something next week. But I already made my predictions. We love Cappy Games that, so. at Day of the Devs. They've been making incredible games for 20 they years. They ended it with Onion Ring. You might know them for games like Below or Super Brothers Sword and Sorcery. Or maybe you know Thank their you. incredible puzzle games like Ryan Snow. No Wolverine. I didn't think Wolverine would show. I don't know why anybody thought well, that. Well, if you're in the ladder, we're um, very excited to announce. If, they, if they're not going to unless it's like a Wolverine shows up in something else. We got Valor for console. We got an eight-minute trailer for that. Hi, and also I'm we got a five-minute ad games. for, and I'm for some mobile Captain game. Straight I forgot what it's called now. We're so thrilled today to be able to give Soon you a first too, look what we've been up to at the studio since releasing Oh, we made, uh, the Lollipop Chainsaw remake trailer coming? Battle yeah, I was wondering when the fuck that... We're gonna get that. Oh yeah, the Power Rangers game looked good. great. There was some good stuff. The first half, awesome. The skate ad was pretty funny. There was some good stuff, especially in the first half. There was a lot of really good stuff. But uh, yeah, it was it was just it, it, Jeff Keighley doesn't know. I, I feel like he, he's been doing these shows for years. And he still doesn't know how to balance the show a little bit better. Because I'm assuming he thinks, all right, first half. You know, people are going to, you know, watch it's that more so than they will watch the second the half, right? Um, so show. put all the good stuff in the first half and then last half, you know, whatever. We'll put some a lot of ads towards the end, which I actually, I, if you're gonna put ads, I guess put ads towards the last half, I guess. But a spiritual successor to one of Captain's most beloved classic games. I wouldn't mind it if the ads Clash were like good or new, but like he's showing stuff that is combat design to send not an that entertaining that to watch or its most interesting facts. stuff we've seen already. I don't know. All right, so I'm gonna end it here. Thank you, everybody that showed up. I don't even know how many more, how many people are still here, but uh, thank you, anybody. That's our uh, outlaws thing looked fine. It looked like it looked like it could be good. Defenders. We'll see. The rapid fire matches last. Yeah, couple of the hype like isn't was like up here, and it stayed like this for a little while, and then it just kept going down. Spend the season the buying half. the title of champion. Should the I get celebrate? Celebrate was awesome. Which team takes the crown? Yeah, Choose so I'll be back in about an hour for the Devolver thing, which will only be like maybe 20, 30 minutes long. So. And, home arena. Uh, and then I'll be we back for, I think, future game show tomorrow, and then on Sunday I'll be definitely be back for at least Xbox. I don't know about PC gaming every. show. There's a lot of stuff that to jump into. I'm not PC but gamer, so it's like whatever. But. You'll unlock new units. Anyway, again, I'll be back uh, in about an hour. So, bye bye. Thank you, everybody that showed up. Thank you to, to the, uh, the tipper from earlier, too. I appreciate that. Captains run the place um, with big personalities and, uh, and outsized power in the form of time turning special abilities. Thank you, everybody.